hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to mine crypto on your pc now a lot of people make mining crypto on pc very complex and it takes a lot of time but this will be set up in less than 15 minutes now head to your browser and then search for nicehash okay so you can see nicehash.com click on it okay so click on more by the right over here and then click on miners and tools over here now you're going to see nicehash miner nicehash quick miner but we are going to use nice hash miner because i've been using it for a while and it's actually working great so let's download that okay so it is now downloading now that is actually all we need to start mining next thing we have to do is to create an account on nice hash so let's click on get started now let's create an account so we've successfully created an account on nice hash so let's click on select service cryptocurrency wallet and cryptocurrency mining so let's start using nice hash so you can see your total asset so when you're mining on your pc it will be accumulating here and this is where you will draw from transfer or make any other transaction you want to make so you can see wallets and different options over here you can create any of these wallets and receive crypto as well so let's start the mining now we have to install nice hash we already downloaded so let's install Now take note, there may be issues with your Windows Defender or any other antivirus you use, so you need to disable it. Now I won't really disable mine since the antivirus has other functions, so I'll only add an exception so it would avoid anything concerning this program. So let's run the program and then see. So you can see our antivirus has removed the program and we can no longer see our downloaded file here. Now let's search for Windows Defender. This is Windows Security. Let's go to the Virus and Threat Protection. And you can see that my system is using Avast Antivirus to protect me. So I will just open the app. Now it's very easy. Disable your antivirus and everything will be back on. So let's go to... So go to Protection. And then go to the Quarantine section. And you're going to see over here our file has been moved. So let's click on it restore and add exception so it's going to ignore this file no matter what now we can begin the installation so let's run our file again accept next now let's finish and you can see our antivirus has deleted the files again so let's cancel this now open antivirus and you can see lots of files over here so we're just going to select all and then add exception now if you want to get rid of these at once you can just disable the antivirus but i wouldn't really recommend that since you will have other things you use your antivirus for so we've successfully added exceptions to all our files now we can run the program again so let's run our nice hash miner accept the terms select your language next now let's log in by clicking on login so login with your email and password and then confirm with the confirmation code verify so we successfully logged in and we can start mining so let's click on ok now go to devices over here and you can see your graphics card and your cpu what is going to be used for this mining now we can enable all and when we are ready to start mining we just have to click on this or this or we click on start all and it will start mining so you can check out other things here the plugins you can install more plugins if you want so to start mining all we need to do is click on start all now take note this may drain your pc so make sure you're sure of what you're doing So guys you can see we are now mining with our cpu our gpu couldn't make it and let's see how that goes so for now everything is still at 0.00, .00. so let's run this for like five minutes and see how it's going so this is extremely low now let's restart our nice hash miner and then try again So let's start mining 
now the reason why this is actually very low is due to my pc hardware so i would want you to try this on your machine and then update in the comment section how much you could mine on your pc per day so from what we can see here uh, we will get 0.02 usd per day which is terribly low so mining on my machine is not profitable plus i will have to pay a very huge electricity bill due to the power usage now if we go to NiceHash and then refresh you're gonna see that one of my machine is running the mining and you can stop mining from here as well so you can turn on your machine while it is mining at home and you are at work when you want to stop the machine from mining you just click on stop or rig and it will stop your machine from mining wherever you are without going there to stop it manually so this is really helpful but i don't think i would be able to do something like this you can see it is actually terrible but i encourage you to try it out and then update us in the comment section if this was helpful kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification thank you for watching and i will see you on the next one